Well, good afternoon. Welcome to Sorpin Technologies, and we're here to talk about some really great stuff. First of all, having my last bit of espresso for the day, and I'm drinking out of my caffeine cup, as you can tell. Side chain reactions. Oh my god, what the heck is a side chain reaction? Um, well, that's what happens when your compound can, that you're purifying, can create a little bit of something extra. And a lot of times, you don't see that when you're doing small scale. You may not see it doing HPLC, you may not even see it doing prep, even small scale flash. But when you start scaling up, you could start seeing impurities or your compound just begin to totally crystallize and crash out because of some side chain reaction. Um, I spoke to actually a couple chemists today regarding that because they've got some projects that we're working with that they are seeing some unique side chain reactions, things that they definitely do not want. And things that they do not want is things that they do not want. So, here are some thoughts that we have in discussing, discussing ways to uh, maybe help n alleviate side chain reactions, because I think what we want to do here is give you some tips. First of all, it comes from really looking at your uh, procedure, looking at both making sure that you do great sample prep, making sure that your solvents are very high purity, and also that you condition your resins properly. That's right there, right up front. And a lot of times, uh, chemists are in a rush. They do not have the time to really think about the conditioning steps. So when they scale up, they're also doing that same behavior. So we want to stress for you good behavior, good procedure, so that you can avoid these unexpected little presents that you get. The other thing is the purity of the resins. We believe that, in speaking to a couple of my chemist friends, um, that the quality of the silica gel they use is very important. They've seen where they've used lower cost, low price silica gels, and they've seen their products just crash out. They didn't see it on small scale, but they saw it when they scaled up. And that's one of the things that we as a company can offer you. Our premium grade silicas, both granular and spherical, are of the highest purity, lowest metal content lowest metal content, so you don't have any possible interaction with metals to possibly create unique complexes. Um, our aluminas are great, very, very high purity. Also, looking at bonded phases. When you utilize bonded phases, not all are equal, the same as silica gel, and the quality that the manufacturers take to really thoroughly wash their silica, probably bond and wash and make sure everything is uh, made correctly is also important. And we offer, again, the highest quality and the highest purities here, so you will not see uh, side lanes coming off or unique complexes created because it was a low cost product. Also, looking at polymeric resins, there's a lot going on there, so you have to be very careful when you begin scaling up. If you have these challenges, if you have these questions, what do you do? You give us a call. And we work great with a lot of the best manufacturers in the world, and their chemists can help you uh, scale up your process to maximize efficiency. Otherwise, look, have a great day. We're excited. It's a thankful Thursday here at Sorbin Technologies. Tomorrow's Fantastic Friday. Get a cup, man. It's awesome. Peace.